à Tiem, bonjour à tout le monde, je suis à Cannes maintenant et euh, quand j'ai dit ça à mes amis que je suis à Cannes, on me dit ok oui parce que c'est ton, ton endroit préféré, it's your favorite place, it's my favorite place Cannes. Actually, if you want to know, today is the end of October, today is 27th of October, 27 octobre aujourd'hui c'est ça Donc euh, il fait, parce que je ne me rappelle pas quel jour c'est, I don't remember what day we are today because I'm on vacations finally. Today is plus 23 degrees. Can you imagine it? And I was swimming today. Marielle is playing in the water too and you now playing in the sand. There are a lot of kids playing in the water as you can see there and a lot of people who are have taken their you know having their tan, having tan, getting tan and there are also why I love Cannes actually is because there is always something happening here and there are always interesting people who we meet. For example, we, uh, when we were at the beach today, we met um, a Russian woman. So Marielle met um, her son. It was interesting to talk because she works uh, with um, both the Russian people who are living in uh, Monaco, Monte Carlo and Monte Carlo and um, it's great their problems are how to invest their money where like they <laughs> they're thinking about okay what should I do today what I, am I going to do what I'm going to do with my uh, 1 billion euros <laughs> so they're looking for ways to invest so they buy the hotels and so they make their money work and hope one day I'm going to be thinking that way too one idea for people who are looking for ways to make money and they are thinking, oh, which country should I go? Where should I make money? First, I can give you like an example. I lived in Moscow and I was you know, like a simple student. I was living in a dormitory and I was making a lot of money. Like today, I think it's about 2,000 euros per se. And at that moment, it was like, great, I could travel. But I, at the same time, I was uh, studying, so it was wonderful. When I came to Paris, I started to make less money because um, I don't know why. I think there are a lot of more, a lot more opportunities um, in Moscow, for example, in Luxembourg, in New York, in, uh, in London. I don't know for sure, but I think uh, too. But mm, I think you should make more. You should make money outside of France and for sure Monaco, Monte Carlo and then you come here to enjoy and to enjoy your life. Talking about these people that I mentioned who are wealthy, that they come to Monaco, Monte Carlo, they don't, they pay zero um, taxes in Monaco. So they come with their wealth, they made all their money, all their fortune outside. So look for ideas outside in the US, in Russia, anywhere and come to enjoy life in France and Monaco because here you have lots of opportunities. If you don't if you do not agree with me, like like this video or dislike this video if you want and leave me a comment below. What do you think about this idea? Should do do you think you can make like a lot of money here in France and pay extraordinary taxes here? Or you agree with me that you should make money in Moscow or elsewhere and then um, sell all your businesses and well, part of them and come to Monaco and enjoy your life here. What do you think? This is my private chat, you see. <laughs> One day I'm gonna travel by private chats too. <laughs> and right there you have a lot of yachts. It's wonderful. It's very beautiful and luxury here and accessible because this beach is free everyone can go here and enjoy this beautiful beautiful view amazing amazing sand this is my mom <laughs> and i'm gonna ask her a couple of questions in russian are you ready mom what's an actually что ты думаешь по поводу того факта что в монако едут не зарабатывать деньги, а уже едут люди, которые заработали огромные-огромные 
капиталы, и они просто туда приедут, приезжают, чтобы не платить налоги за свои капиталы, естественно, ну и дальше наслаждаться жизнью. Что ты об этом думаешь? Ну, вообще-то можно, конечно, не согласиться. Потому что в основном нужно, конечно же, зарабатывать там деньги, где есть работа, и в странах, где дают возможность заработать эти деньги. А в Франции не заработаешь больше денег. Есть возможность, но это очень редкие, в редкий случай. Поэтому многие уезжают из Франции, высокие налоги, зарабатывают либо в Москву едут, и тем самым обеспечивают свою семью, себя, приезжают опять в Европу, чтобы отдохнуть, насладиться, потратить свои денежки, свой капитал вложить и насладиться этой шикарной жизнью. Да. Какие страны, как ты думаешь, могут позволить тебе заработать высокие капиталы? На мой взгляд, это, конечно же, по-моему, такие страны, Какие города? как Россия, Москва, да. Нью-Йорк, Люксембург. И можно поехать даже в северные страны, такие как Норвегия, Швеция. Но там налоги повыше. Не знаю. Но в основном люди приезжают оттуда, отдыхают здесь. Да, это Даже точно. Не... Спасибо тебе за такой комментарий. Airbnb and right now we actually um, contacted the same people so we don't go through Airbnb we go directly to the people's contact so it's less expensive and what I suggest to you is just to make connections here while you're in Cannes with rentals for example so you, you can pay less, much less expensive than you would pay by um, Airbnb and also like meet people, be open-minded and be open to your opportunities. <laughs> I'm going sleep maybe right now and yeah, hope to see you next time and love you. <laughs>